Hello everyone, my name is Infinity and this is Magnetize Yourself, where we talk about life, love, spirituality, and of course the law of attraction. Today we're going to be talking about signs that remote seduction is working. I really wish I had a video like this when I first set about using remote seduction in my own life because it can be so frustrating when you feel like you're trying to attract a specific person into your life. Obviously, there's a buffer of time. You're not seeing it happen yet and you're wondering if the things you're doing are even working. Well, this video is going to answer that question and show you very powerful signs that it is working, that you are attracting this person into your life. But first, for anyone that's new to my videos, I always mention several subliminal tracks throughout the video that you can use as tools. Tools to help you use the law of attraction in your own life and manifest anything you desire. I've created a library of over 100 extremely powerful subliminal tracks for every area of life. These are all featured on my website, soundandsoulful.com. I believe in these tracks so much that I'm offering a seven day free trial to all new members. So you can sign up, try out any of the tracks I mentioned in this video completely for free. And I promise you within that first seven days of consistent listening, you will begin to see major energetic shifts in your life. All of that information will be in the description box. You can click any of the links for the tracks and read more about what is contained in every subliminal. Read more about how it can transform your mind, your energy, and your life. So with that said, let's get right into the signs remote seduction is working. So all of these signs are identical in this way. Each of these signs is an indication of a deepening energetic bond with this person. And that's really the whole goal with remote seduction, right? Like I say, attraction to another person is energetically based. When we say we're attracted to someone, what we mean is we are feeling an energetic pull toward them. We're sensing, sensing, excuse me, a deep energetic bond with that person. The thing is, with remote seduction, we can actually consciously create, cultivate, and strengthen this kind of attractive, magnetic, energetic bond with anyone on the planet. So, all of these signs are just indications that you have deepened your connection with this person on an energetic level. And when you see any of these signs, take it as a sign from the universe that you are very close to manifesting a relationship with them. So the first sign is you start frequently dreaming of them. This is a very powerful sign because our dreams are more than just subconscious imaginings of the mind. Often our dreams are reflections of what is going on in the collective consciousness, especially as it relates to us. And I know that sounds kind of confusing. So let me elaborate a little bit on that. Because when we sleep, our conscious mind is dormant, our subconscious mind is wide open and at its most impressionable. And this means that although we are able to sense, pick up on, and interpret energy from others all day long, 
it's much easier for us to do this, this kind of energetic interpreting while we're sleeping. So often, when we dream about someone, it actually means we're receiving some kind of telepathic message from that person. And for this reason, if you're dreaming about the person you're trying to attract into your life, if you're having dream interactions with them, especially if these interactions are romantic in nature, this is a very good sign remote seduction is working for you. The second sign isn't so much a literal thing that happens, but a feeling. If you begin to feel deeply at peace about the situation, about the relationship, about this person, this is actually a sign that you have finally, truly let go. You finally have reached a point where you believe in your own power, your own creative ability to manifest anything in your life. You've finally reached a point where you're able to fully trust the universe, fully trust the divine timing of your life. And your faith that this person is manifesting is so strong You no longer feel worried or afraid or anxious. If you reach that point, remote seduction is working because that kind of state of mind is where manifestation magic happens. If you're not at that point, don't feel bad because all of us have trouble reaching that state of complete faith on different subjects in our lives. I've created a subliminal track designed to help you clear out subconscious negativity, boost your faith in yourself, in your creative power, in the law of attraction. And when you boost your faith, you become a magnet for anything you desire, including the relationship with this specific person. So again, that subliminal will be linked in the description box if you're interested. Now, this is my favorite sign because it's one that's very obvious, but also very important to notice and very meaningful. When remote seduction is working, you will begin to see signs of this person everywhere. And I don't mean literally physically seeing them, although that could be a separate sign because you may find that you run into them more often. It's one of those side effects of having a deeper energetic bond with someone. Anyway, this is when you start seeing or hearing their name everywhere. And other people may try to tell you it's just because you're interested in them, you're just focused on them more, but I'm telling you, it will be impossible that it could just be that because you will be seeing their name so much more frequently than you ever did before. And if not their name, you'll be seeing things that remind you of them all the time. So maybe one time they told you that their favorite animal was a llama. All of a sudden, you will see things about llamas everywhere. That's just a random example. Maybe they live in a different city and it's a small town in your state and no one's really heard of it. Well, when remote seduction is working its magic, you might start seeing things about that city everywhere, which is crazy because you never saw anything about it before. This happens because as you deepen the energetic bond you have with this specific person, you put yourself in line with them in a way that causes your life paths to cross, not just in physical ways, but in energetic ways. So think of it as being on the same wavelength as this person. You will start getting signs from the universe about them everywhere. And I promise when this happens, you won't be able to help but notice it. So the last and most obvious sign is that this person reaches out to you. I had to include this on the list, even though it is a bit more obvious, 
because many people make the mistake of thinking that if this person doesn't immediately say, I love you, I want to be with you forever, or I want to date you, then remote seduction isn't working. But that's not true. As we know, with any manifestation, there's always a buffer of time. I always say with whether you're listening to subliminals or journaling or meditating, whatever you're doing to manifest, you should always give it at least 21 days because very solid research has shown it takes that long for the brain to form new habit loops. So whenever you're trying to Excuse me, as you deepen your connection with this person, they will sense it. And if you're not in contact, they may not reach out right away, but they will sense it immediately. That's what I tell members on my site is the thing is when you do something to deepen your bond with this person. So in my case, say you're listening to my subliminal created to attract this specific person. This is a very, very powerful affirmations track because it literally energetically forges, creates a bond between you and this person that's like a magnet. But the thing is, when that bond is first created, that person is unlikely to immediately ask you out, immediately text you. They might. I mean, I've seen it happen within you know, days or weeks, they might reach out fast, but most of the time what happens is at first they sense the energy you're sending toward them and their brain interprets it as causing them to think about you, but they might not let you know that. In fact, they probably won't let you know that right away. It's like your energy begins to tug on their mind. Have you ever had an experience where you met someone and you didn't really think much of them at all and then you parted ways and then slowly they just kept coming back into your mind and you had no idea why it was like every time that thought would occur you'd kind of push it out they were basically a stranger to you but somehow there was this connection there And over time, it got you more and more curious about who this person was until you took some kind of action, whether it was trying to find them on Facebook or trying to meet them or trying to figure out who they are. This is how remote seduction works too. So the minute, you know, within minutes of doing even your first law of attraction practice, whatever remote seduction technique you use, say you're listening to one of my remote seduction subliminals. Honestly, within minutes of listening to this, this person will kind of receive an energetic message from you. They'll be able to sense this bond with you. Your face and name may even pop into their mind in that moment, but they probably won't reach out right away because it takes time normally for us to allow the thoughts in our mind to motivate us to action. So by the time that this person has actually made some kind of contact with you, whether it's saying hello to you if you're still somewhat strangers on the street, or maybe they text you, but they just say, hey, or what's up or something like that. This is very significant because it means that Your energy has been pulling on them long enough that this bond has deepened for long enough that they are beginning to find the energy irresistible. They're beginning to feel pulled toward you and that is motivating them to take action. So you can take this as a very clear sign that remote seduction is working. I hope this video was helpful for you. As I said, I've mentioned a few subliminals in this video. I have several designed specifically for remote seduction, whether you want to make someone think about you, cause them to dream about you, deepen your energetic bond with them, or attract a relationship with them. I have subliminals for each and every one of these manifestations in the description box. 
click any of the links to explore more about each track. Thank you so much for listening to this podcast. You can follow me on Instagram at magnetize yourself all put together. And if I resonated with you, I hope you'll consider subscribing to this channel, joining our community here of like-minded creative beings. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for sharing this space here on my channel. Have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you in the next podcast.